Hello, welcome to Redhead Art and our Halloween special. We will be sharing our usual cute and easy crafts, but in a ghoulish environment. So come in and take a look and see what we have for you today. So, you're here for the Halloween talk show. Hi. <gasps> oh my goodness, what's it's happened? <laughs> well, I think you can tell me about these. Oh well, these are our very first Halloween craft for you. They are made from rocks. Never. Yeah, really easy, really fun. Paint your rock white and then add uh, details like bloodshot eyes. Bloodshot eyes. So I it's love basically them. a coloured circle uh, with a little bit of black to bring it um, you know, to the forefront and then some little red lines. Great, really nice photographs. And also, originally, we used um, glow in the dark paint on these. Wow, yeah, so nice. they do glow in the dark. Yeah, really they're good for trick or treating photographs just before exactly. you set out. Although the glow in the dark paint doesn't last very long. Yeah, okay. so, but it's still fun, really fun. And what else could you wear trick or treating, Maggie? You tell me. <laughs> How mm. about a nice hat? I think they look good in this. That's really sweet, isn't it? <laughs> actually, I quite like that for kids and for grown-ups, yeah. don't you think? Well, that's good for me, actually, yeah. because although um, I do like trick-or-treating with my children, um, I'm not one for full costume, so I might wear some sort of stripy yeah. tights and a little hat. You know what? And that would go really well with oh, your rather spectacular this. witch's skirt. This is made from bin liners, oh. so it's something that everyone has at home like it. and it can made be really, really quickly. I like, quickly. I like the orange and green touches you've got yeah. in here. Yeah, really sweet. Re um, really, really easy make and really fun. And the thing is you can make it any length to suit you or a child. Yeah. And also, we were messing around earlier. Oh yeah. It's a good look, Maggie. It's a good look. It can be a wig. <laughs> it's a really big look. <laughs> Anyway, fun with that, uh, really easy, um, DIY, no sew tutu. Really no, what easy. about um, yeah. something for your goodies when you're uh, trick-or-treating? These wow. really nice bags that we made. Um, do you guess what these are? Can you tell Ooh, me this I time? think, well, let's have a look. They're sort of apple shaped, so we did a bit of potato yeah. printing with apples. Pumpkin shapes and then yeah, yeah little marker pen. So that's a really nice, if you've got young kids, you can do those in the afternoon. Yeah. Um, the paint we used dried really quickly and then you can use them that same night. So it's really fun for little kids as well, apple printing, they love yeah, that, don't they? Nice. Yeah, really you can have it all over, it doesn't even just yeah. have to be three. Like oh, wrapping paper. paper. Wrapping paper, yeah. really yeah. lovely. Yeah. Really lovely, talking of trick-or-treating, um, if you're having a trick-or-treat party, so we've made these little uh, bats made from toilet rolls, no less. Now they look sweet as a little decoration on the table, but what we've done before is we've um, put some treats in, stuffed a bit of tissue paper in to kind of hold them in place and attached a piece of string mm. and then the children get to pull a little mini pinatas. Little mini pinatas and in some you could have sweets and some you could have spooky worms and spiders and stuff so they can be like booby trapped. Oh. You know, they can be really fun. Obviously, my kids would want the booby trap yes. ones because they think that's brilliant. But these work really well as mini pinatas. Really got a, sweet. We've got another. Is this a toilet roll as well, or is this kitchen roll? Kitchen roll, cut in half, toilet yeah. roll, whatever you prefer. Yeah. What's in there? Some treats. <laughs> What yes. would you do with those? Yes, well this is candy corn um, type decoration yeah, yeah. and again you, you just fill them with um, little, uh, in the, I think in there they've actually got some plastic rings, oh. a little um, Halloween yo-yo, nice. um, but of course I mean if you're using kitchen roll you can yeah. put sweets in there and then if you're having a party again I think these are quite nice, you can hand these out as a little um, gift at the yeah. end and it's kind of it's got that candy corn Yeah, it's nice, it. I like it And it's made from a little roll, really easy, you go click one side, twist it, click the other side. Perfect. Super easy nice to make. Paint, nice paint job, nice paint job. Exactly. Talking of recycling. Yes, and paint jobs. And paint jobs. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, my kids love this. Now this is actually meant to be, um, actually it's made, made from uh, drink cartons, so like a juice or milk. Soy milk. Or soy milk. <laughs> from my recycling box. <laughs> it's actually made from soy milk. <laughs> and uh, you can put little lights, tea lights in here, mm. and it lights up, but you can play with it as well. Perfect. So you know, so depending on the age um, of, of you, the viewer, you might like it as a decoration in your home uh, and it would look really sweet. Like in the chimney. I know, sweet. <laughs> and also if you see here, I made the cartons pointing different directions mm. so the chimneys, it could slightly different effect. One house a bit bigger, one a bit slower, uh, lower. But mine like to play with their little toys. So it's their spooky house for their little toys. You know the ones you get in surprise bags? Oh yes. Brilliant. So so with, with the um, little electric tea lights? Yeah, or without, yeah. but they've got the door. But they speaking of tea lights, yes. moving on. Swiftly. <laughs> Clearly that was my cue for talking too much. <laughs> Never. <laughs> well, I love milk those. cartons. More, more juice milk cartons. We have a lot yeah. of rummaging in our we recycling do. boxes, yeah. don't we? Like we? That, so yeah. we found these, um, and well, I wanted to use these milk cartons uh, with the flat back and <laughs> lo and behold, we realised this makes quite a good nose. And then the eye sockets, a bit of marker pen, and then on these ones we can just cut in the back 
really sweet. And a nice little lantern. Now, I love those as lanterns, but you know what? I think they'd be really cool to stick it in a full bottle of milk. And then when you open the fridge well, on Halloween enough, morning. Yeah, that is just so funny. <laughs> a, whole, a whole whole shelf full of spooky milk. <laughs> yeah, I think it's really funny, don't you think? The kids would love that. Now we've got two little ones. Very little. A little dinky. <laughs> conkers. Conkers. Now conkers are chestnuts or buckeyes, depending on which part of the world you're from. And we just glued them together, added some little wings, and it's more little, googly eyes. More googly eyes. Let's hold that still because you're wobbling that oh, around. Sorry. I don't know whether you can see that. A little bat pencil, just a bit of fun. Again, that's the sort of thing you'd make at a little um, craft, Halloween craft party with kids. And similarly, this one as well. And I think this is quite sweet. I think the legs have gone a bit wonky <laughs> on the way over. So it's a little pom-pom spider. <laughs> so you make your pom-pom the regular way. And before you cut it, you push in lots of pipe cleaners and you tie your wall round and cut your pom-pom. <laughs> and at the very end, you glue on some googly eyes. This is actually really sweet for any insy wincy spider lovers. As well. Oh, goodness, really sweet. <laughs> Right then, we're coming to the end of our video and we've hopefully kept the best till last. These are my wizard's wands. Or witches, if or you're me. Witches, well, we've shown you almost all of the yeah. costume. You've got your hat, you've got the tutu. And don't go and leave the house without your I love it. wand. Nice yeah. for Harry Potter too, actually. Very good for yeah. Harry Potter fans. So, I hope you liked our crafts today. Don't forget to subscribe to both Red Ted Art and Incredibly Busy. Incredibly Busy. Incredibly Busy. And we'll see you here for the next Halloween ghoulish video. See you soon.